Woohoo! That's the cost of a Dukes. Hello again, everyone. It is the Black Knight. And today, because we have all kinds of specials going on, we got some double money, double RP going on with missions. No, we don't need a cheat code. What we're going to do is we're going to load into a closed crew session. Found out that you can do contact missions from a crew session or a closed crew session. That's about as restrictive as you're going to get without actually going solo. Boof, boof, boof. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to try and take advantage of that double money. And I've looked around the internet and I've tried to determine what are the people's favorite, you know, contact missions and what are the best contact missions, the most successful contact missions. And there really isn't a consensus on, uh, well, you know, this is a very personalized kind of thing. So what I decided to do is come up with a playlist of what I consider... The lazy man's contact missions. That's right. The, the contact missions are someone who doesn't want to work very hard to make a good amount of money. That's where I think we're going to do here today. So let me show you that. I picked four because, you know, really, you know, why would you want to go through? If I'm lazy, obviously, well, why would I want to go through like lots and lots of them? Um, there, there, I mean, there are a lot of good missions in a time like this. It's good to cycle through a whole bunch of them, try different things, keep you from being bored. But if you just want to make money... The low risk, low stress, low effort way. This is the way to do it. Now you'll notice I'm not at the office. You know we're not going to do anything with pajamas here. We're not doing any of the uh, CEO stuff. There are CEO bonuses going on. If you do special cargo, you get 25% bonus on selling, and we may do that. Um, I'm a little, a little wary about doing that at this particular. Oh come on, go ahead and get me out of here. At this particular time, because I still don't know what the hacker situation is. I, mean, I know Rockstar has been patching the living heck out of stuff, let's put it that way. But I don't know where we're at. So, for right now, if I can make tons of money in a closed crew session for the short term. As you can see, I still haven't painted any of these uh, cars here, except for the one on the end. Interesting sub note. I went to move my uh, this car... The Duke of Death up to the front, and they have removed the blue blip from your garage. I, I don't know how the heck you move cars around anymore. You can watch TV. You, your cars are where your cars are, and that's just kind of annoying. But I think that was to deal with some kind of duplication glitch. And I'm thinking, yeah, before you deal with the dupe glitches, why don't we get rid of, like, you know, people ripping you to shreds? But here we are in the Ookmobile now. We just have to load up our playlist, which I'll put a link in the description if I can figure out how to do that, uh, to my social club where I sh it should be available. Like, this should be uploaded and available someplace. Let's go playlists. I don't have a... I, this is really one of the first playlists I've ever done. I think I might have like a racing one. I don't even remember what's in at the races, but lazy contacts. That's right. The simple kind of things here. Are you sure you want to start the playlist? Okay. And you get a little bit more XP, I think, for doing the playlist. Although at this point in the game, I'm not concerned too much about XP. Boom, boom, boom. All right. The first one is, of course, Blow Up. Blow Up is probably my favorite of all of the uh, the contact missions. Because, well, you'll, you'll see why. It's just, you know, we'll get some armor. Not that we should need it. We got full ammo. Confirm settings. Load that puppy up. Now, I'm not going to necessarily milk this for all it's worth. If you if you stretch this out 10 or 15 minutes, then you'll get... We, we could theoretically do the time warp again and do that. Uh, but I only have so much time to film. And so I'm going to probably just rock you through these, show you how to do them. And I'll tell you where you can just kind of rest and... Not worry about things. It's, it's, uh, we'll, we'll get to that point. But here we are. Now we're in the Duke of Death just for the fun of having the Duke of Death. You don't need the Duke of Death to do this one. Um, the Duke of Death does make some of them rather easy. Now what I'm doing is that this is not a required step. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to tuck all of these cars into a corner. Basically you just stuff them all together. So we can reduce the number of explosives we need here. All we really need to do is destroy these cars. And 
classically the way I've done this is by putting, oh, I don't know, like three or four stickies on it. So that we can, you know, just hit the button and they all blow up. I'm trying to do it now with at least one or two grenades just to keep it constant. And I've, I, I've done it where I could get them all in one grenade. It's not high enough to this caught up on the finger wells here. Let's get this up here. Again, this is a completely unnecessary step. It's just me having fun with the brutal gas. And maybe if I can get this one shoved more now. This is as good. Oh wait, we can do one more thing. We go from this side. But we have a little more room. We might be able to get them all tucked up. Can we hunt? There we go. Let's let's just line up here. Back it up to the wall. Let's go here. Drop the hammer. Boom. All right. You shove everything right in the car. Now you want to want to have your car lined up for the getaway. That helps. Lined up for the getaway. Now, if you do this just right, you won't get any stars. You can end up with a good number of stars on this. But let's toss one there. Can we do it in one? Boom, 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 boom. Not quite. We got one. Oh, we did. We did it in one. We just threw one extra for a good measure. Ba boom, ba boom, ba boom. Run. That's pretty much it. Now all we have to do is drive back to uh, Simeon's place. See that? Now we did that. We blew everything up without getting a wanted level. And this is set to hard. I mean, you can see why I like this. If you wait the uh, the full 15 minutes or so, you get in excess of 30,000. 30,000 dollars. I, mean, I think you have about 33, I think I can, I can max it out at. If you, do, if you run here right now, you won't get much. But we'll, we'll see, what would you get if you just did? I think you'd probably get like five or 6,000. But if you wait, I mean, and you could do you could do all kinds of stuff while you wait. You can go and just drive around and mess with people with the Duke of Death. That's always fun. Good morning, Mr. Cadillac. Whoa! Oh dear, I didn't. That wasn't at all what I wanted. And now I've got a wanted level that I gotta lose. So I screwed that up. So here's what not to do: don't uh, go flying into pay to people while you're doing this because it will grant you a wanted level. That was a mistake. Big time mistake. Don't do that. Pop this around. Look where are the police? They're up there. Let's let's slide in behind. Let's see if we can. Good news, I'm pregnant again. Just hide. That one there. We got. Oh, we're getting triangulated. This ain't good. We've got. You don't want. To, you don't want him to even see a little bit. So this goes to two stars. Because then shortly after that, you'll have to start shooting stuff, and we'll go to three stars. Zipping around here. Oh, look, isn't this part of Brophy's track? Yeah, I think it is. News van. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Come on. It's only a one star. It shouldn't take an hour. But this is making us some more money. You know, that, that's a good thing. The delay will make us some more cash. All right, so we got away from that stupid mistake where we got flipped into the air and then landed on people. I, I was expecting just to punt that Cadillac right in the next week like I normally do. But let's move, let's get through this, get on to the next one here. If you, if, what you can do, just park it here, go get a drink, wait a while, kill 10, 15 minutes, you get a whole bunch more money. But we're going to pull it right through here because we, we want to, I want to get through the whole playlist with you. Show you how easy some of this stuff is. Perfect. Well, not perfect, but it will do for now. Perfection is a cruel mistress. Yeah, so is your wife. Okay, so let's see here now. Mission pass. What did we get out of that? 15 JP points or JIP points. 18,000 is not bad. Now, that would have been 9,000 on a normal day. That's not a bad path to 9K, you know what I mean? So that's, here we are, 18K there. And you can pump that up to 30. Easily can be done. Now we're continuing. Hope it doesn't take the full 22 seconds to continue. We just want to continue. 
Come on. Downloading. There we go. All right. So now, our next one is, of course, Death Metal. Now, Death Metal does take some effort. See, we only spent $374 on ammo there. Confirm settings. Now, starting a job on our own. Now, this is one where if you can get yourself an armored car like the Duke of Death, life becomes really simple. You can do this without it. I mean, this is an early level kind of thing. It can be done. But watch how easy it is with the Duke of Death. You could probably argue that it's better with the Karuma, but I mean, the Duke of Death is the hot thing right now. And yeah, we have to kill a whole bunch of people here. Now, you're going to want us to hang back, because your angle of fire on the Duke of Death is really quite terrible. They pretty much have to be in front of you. You don't want them to get up on you, because they can pull you out of the car and things will go down. You don't want to get yourself surrounded. Though. You want to hang back. Just blast the crap out of people as much as you can. For some reason, the police don't care that I'm doing this. It's just how it is. There's a guy right there. Help! Now we have to move in a little bit. It'd be interesting to do this with the Ruiner. I'm not sure if we could do it with the Ruiner 2000. We might try that at some point. Okay, we got guys mostly in this direction now. We might have to go around the Okay, here we go. We got one behind the purple car. This guy just wants to get shot. Right in the ground. Remember, kids, uh, I don't want to encourage you to do any violence in real life. This isn't something you would do. It's not a good thing. I, my character is not a good person for doing this kind of stuff for money. Not necessarily, I'm not being particularly efficient here with my bullets. I'm just like, hey, I'm lazy. I got a bulletproof car. Theoretically, they could shoot me through the front window. I haven't yet to find an NPC that, that's, that is that good a shot. Is that everyone? I think that's everyone, ladies and gentlemen. So there we go. We pick up the Coke. If we want to, we could pick up a couple extra bugs and some ammo. I don't know. I don't think you can steal the baller because I don't think you can get back into your garage while the mission's going. Um, anybody else here? Yeah, that's enough. The baller. Uh, gotta get one of those for the Top Gear garage at some point. Now you can see that all the bullets have been taken by this wonderful car of mine. Oh, here's some stuff. Yeah, there's some more stuff to grab. And while I'm running around grabbing stuff like this, do I need to get the gun? No, it's not. The clock's ticking. I mean, we're we're making money. It's the longer it runs, the more money you make. So killing time is a good thing. Again, we can't kill too much time because I want to get through the full playlist while I have time today to do this. Before I, you know, before we go back to other things happening. Okay, don't run over anyway. Now it's just a cruise. Excuse me. You're in the way. I do love this car. And we're going to zip around here. Deliver the coke. Oh, we just shot up a bunch of drug dealers, and now we're gonna give it to another drug dealer. So That's a beat up bicycle. What up, yo? Aye. Aye. And how much did we get? Mission passed. You see, that wasn't too bad. Especially if you got an armored car. 
Another 18,000. Blow up three. Now, you'll notice I skipped blow up two. Blow up two is, in my own opinion, a little bit of a pain in the buns because you're guaranteed a, a three-star wanted level. It's, it's fun. Don't get me wrong. I like doing blow up two. But blow up three is even easier. You have not much resistance. There is some you're going to want to get in the car. And all the bulletproofness. At some point, I'll have to get myself an armored Kuruma just to see if that's even better. I think, yeah, you could shoot in all directions with an armored Kuruma, but they still can't shoot it. Which doesn't make a whole lot of sense. I know, it looks like they're just mining their own business. And these guys are just car salesmen. It really is an evil mission. I think I'm shooting the guy in front of He's using his buddy for cover. You dick. Doing the same kind of thing, You're tucking some cars to get it. Yeah, we can't let him uh, get to us. We have to, we have to kill that guy and then set the charges. Now, another thing, if we had the Insurgent, for instance, I could just throw explosives out the window. We're doing kind of a Duke of Death thing here. This is showing you some of the weaknesses of the Duke of Death, that limited arc of fire. Is there anybody else here shooting us? I don't think so. Now, we can do this with grenades, but it's probably... Yeah, let's try it with grenades. One there, one there... See, that car is burning. Ah, well, we're getting resistance. Getting the post car Everybody explosion down. resistance. You motherfucker. He's not happy. I thought we got them. We won left. Keep shooting. Right, and right. Oh, that was just a pleasant. Where's the last car? I thought I got them. Oh, that one. Okay, well. All right. Oh, hey, we could do this grenade launcher. Just for sheer fun of getting it done. That was a little more expensive than I intended, but... Now, I do believe we get more resistance here on the way out. But in the Duke of Death, you don't care. You don't care. Shoot me all you want. It don't matter. You're not going to kill the Duke of Death. Excuse me, I just blew a bunch of stuff up, so I'm not going to worry about your stuff. Strangely enough, no wanted stars. And that's kind of a big deal, no wanted stars. People are still shooting at us, but we just keep the hammer down. And all we gotta do is drive back. And again, this is the sort of thing, once you've, once you've gotten away from the pursuit, I mean, I haven't tested this for a full 15 minutes. I don't know if they'll eventually find you. But you can you can milk this out, get yourself max out the time on it, max out the money on it. In theory, if you do 15 minutes for every single one of these missions, uh, you'll end up with 120k, 120k an hour. Now, usually the way Rockstar does this is there's a sweet spot where if you're doing it for four or five minutes or maybe ten minutes, and you just keep playing it as opposed to letting it kind of idle, you'll actually make more than that. So that's the, that's going to be the trick. You can see I'm losing the sterile field here as far as my audio. As children are now running around the room. <laughs> but we only have one more mission to do. Interesting. Well done. You get a random thank you from depending on what the mission is. So, I mean, we're making 20,000 a shot here. So, I mean, obviously, you do five of these, you're at 100,000. So, we're actually 
on a, on a permission basis here, doing pretty well. Like it. Continue. Do the time warp again. And here we go. Now this one, clean the cat house. Let's see, I actually have to throw a, give a shout out here. I'll put a link in the description to Thomas3630, who put me on for one of his videos to this mission. And you wouldn't think this would be an easy mission. Uh, but with his technique, again, link in the description. Uh, it is, it is actually, it's a, it might be a little bit boring, if anything. But again, I think it definitely qualifies as a lazy mission. Now, let us get here. First thing we want to do, we're pretty close to the location, but for once we're not going to uh, to, to use the Duke O Death. We could probably do this with the Duke O Death, but we're going to call on a Pegasus vehicle. That's the trick of the matter. Hello, you're through to Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help? Great. The aircraft is waiting for you at our nearest airfield. We trust you'll be happy, sir. So let's see, where's the nearest airfield? Over here. Okay, so we don't necessarily want to go right past Anna here. The whole point of this is that we have to rescue uh, Madraza's favorite prostitute from uh, the bad guys. And you can go in, kill everybody, and then get her out. Or you can pretty much do a complete clean mission if you could fly a helicopter very well, which I can. Not a big helicopter kind of guy, but where is the helicopter? There we are. Hauled in my buzzard. So now, here's the trick. There's a certain way that if you do this, this becomes easy. Chopper in. Uh, right here on this set of hotels. Inside here. I'm going too fast. This is, I always end up going back and forth and back and forth. Come on. Now bring it down. Uh, why, am I, why do I struggle so much with helicopters? It's just not right. Always overcorrecting. Come on, drop it. If you bring the helicopter down just the right way. Hi. It's our territory. Shit, damn it. Die, die, die. She figures out that you've come for her and she just gets in the helicopter. And you take off. They'll start shooting at you so you have to run away. But that's it. Theory, all you have to do is bring her back to Martins. And you want to get a good amount of altitude here, because as you can see, cars start coming for you. So you'll start taking bullets. But if we take them over the hills here, then they're not going to be able to come after us very well. And then we just need to Lose them there. Wheel them. Now, see, look, no matter where you go, wherever you get over a road. Now, let's see here. Now, where is... We need to go back kind of the way we came. Just not directly back the way we came. Let's kick this over the water. See, now this is kind of quiet part of the whole thing. It's flying back. Let's do the time warp again. And you gotta admire girls. She doesn't even care about if she just gets into the, the co pilot seat. Just get me on this plane here. I'll hang out to the side. Get a better view of stuff. No fear. This is a no fear prostitute. That's what we got going right here, folks. The only problem with this method is there's not a lot of good places to land. So let's find a place to land. Without wrecking this thing. I mean, somewhere near a road. 
And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to call my mechanic, have him bring up some wheels, and then I'm going to drive her. Because it's just simpler. The last time I tried to do this, I completely totaled the helicopter. Then I'm trying to walk to the place. And uh, it was a complete pain in the buns. We should bring up something stylish. Doesn't need to be stylish. We could, in theory, steal a car. Oh dear, here we go. You want to start getting close to the road. Oh, ow. Take her back to Madrasso's house. Call the mechanic. What you need, boss? Some wheels? I can bring them around. Let's see, what do we want? All right, you know what? I'll bring it by. Let's get crazy. It's still the Easter season here as we're doing this. Look at the ground. Admire the, the what you call Where do we get the, there's the car. Our custom donk. If we're gonna be pimping, let's be pimping. Let's, let's do this here. Do 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 do. Let's head to Madrasso's house. Do 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 do. Head to Madrasso's house. We're gonna go to Madrasso in a big pink donk. We're going to Madrasso. Donk a donk a donk a donk a donk a donk a donk. Okay, I don't know where I'm going with this, but now, obviously, by this point, I expect that we've gotten rid of all of the resistance. Yeah, otherwise, I wouldn't be driving around in a dunk because we're probably going to get cut to ribbons. But if I was concerned, then I could just pull up, you know, the uh, pull up the Duco Death. And again, you don't need the Duco Death. Perhaps we'll do another video at some point with a low-level character. See how it all works out. How much harder it is. But I do have a lower-level character that I can mess with on this. Maybe we'll do that. We'll see if we get the chance. Right now, we're gonna take this girly girl back in the donk. The donk, the donk, the donk, the donk, 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 donk. Back to Madrasso. Thank you. Mission passed, and there was a lot of flying around and stuff in there. I don't even know, but it took it was time consuming. Twenty-eight thousand, so it wasn't probably the full amount of time, but a good amount of it. Boom! And that's your full playlist. That's the four of four. That is the lazy contacts playlist, and you can you can restart this if you wanted to. But as you can see, that is my suggestion. These are my suggestions. I'm going to put a link in the description to this uh, to this playlist. If I come up with any other good lazy contact missions, then I will uh, I will do that. And here we are, the winner of the list. I don't know how you lose. I mean, if I was doing this with people, we'd be doing it all together. Maybe it's whoever gets the most kills or most points or most thingamabobby kind of things and and here we are. We're in the last car we called up. So there we are in the dock. Now, there is there is one elephant in the room, so let, let's address that. Now, the uh, the elephant in the room is no eye Bronca, which is one of the more popular of the contact missions. People might be saying, Black Knight, how could you forget no eye Bronca? And the answer is I didn't. But for as much fun and crazy as no eye Bronca is, these are all NPC cars that during the shootout, for whatever reason, turned right and pull or left and pulled right into the area where the gunfight was taking place completely blocking off the road and i ended up blowing them all up here just to get through people are screaming this is a this is a very elaborate it's a two-stage very elaborate sort of mission you use a lot of ammunition do a lot of shooting do a lot of things and it's not terribly hard i'm not gonna say it's like a difficult it's too difficult mission or anything like that and yes, it's fun, and yes, there's a lot of things that are good about it, but it's not, it's not a lazy mission. I'm going to be perfectly honest. This takes a long time. 
Uh, you do make a lot of money on it because it takes a long time. Uh, you do burn some money because you have to blow a lot of stuff up. And, by the way, I'd just like to point out here, look at all of these uh, vapid Uranuses here that are wrecked all over the place. Why can't we not have the vapid Uranus in game? We need to have that. You all know that I want that one. That's that we gotta get that 5-0 Mustang into this game. The gang leader's fleeing. This was kind of funny. There's the gang leaders in a, a muscle car or something, and this'll be a nice chase. This will be he drives right to the Just like, you know, dirty married crazy Larry, that kind of thing. Look at that, he just completely totals his car out on it. Now it's just a matter of trying to get around on him. He keeps crashing into things. Pin that. Don't wait here. Hold on. I forgot that went to the next file. Hold on a second. Do 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 do. Open with. And that's what happened next. I just shot him right in the, right in the noggin. Then we got our money, and then the mission passed. Thirty-six thousand nine six. You make a lot of money with it. But it takes forever and you're shooting people the whole time. So that's why I didn't include Noi Bronca in the Lazy Man's playlist, although I do recommend it as an excellent one to do. And there you have it, folks. This is your Black Knight. Have a great night. Enjoy those contact missions. <laughs> so glad I didn't have you killed. You're so far you're proving useful.